Okay, this is Gail with Bear Manor Cotons, and I just want to film our puppy setup. So we, first of all, here's our whelping box, and our whelping box is three feet by three feet, and it's got this little lip here, so you can, um, you can, a puppy can slide under here, under this shelf, when the mom is in here nursing, and so as you can see, the puppy can get underneath, and then we put this little rubber strips or these little uh, corrugated strips here that that uh, allow the mother to get traction when she jumps in to the box. So the box is good for about the first two weeks of life and we're talking about Coton de Tuliar dogs here and they are only about 15 pounds as an adult or maybe up to 20 but so she's not that big <laughs> so a three by three box works. And what we've done here is once the puppies get to be two weeks old or so, and right now we have four and a half week old puppies, but once they get to be two weeks old, we make a little pin. So we take this gate here and simply take a little area and take over so if mom has a little bit more of space. So we take over just kind of this area next to the whelping box. As the puppies get older, of course, we add the kennel, we expand the gate, all the way out into the room, and in fact two gates, two puppy pens put together, and have made this whole space here with the tunnel and with all the beds and toys, their water bottles and water bowls, and then we're feeding them out of little plastic trays their goat's milk and their meat. Yes, hello Winnie. Here's a little puppy. She is as I said, four and a half weeks old. So it's nice because then we have the space and we keep expanding it until it is the whole room, actually. <laughs> and the whelping box will go away and the pen will then come and go all the way to the door. And then we just close the gate and we open it when the puppies go in, in the other room and outside. Someone is dreaming. So this is this is the way it works. In about six weeks, they'll be able to go outside. So we have the back door here, and they can go out into the backyard. And of course, the laundry is right here. We're doing laundry all the time. <laughs> Every morning, we change all these pads out. In another week or so, they're going to be able to walk on the linoleum well. We've got a little bit of linoleum that is showing right here but right now they don't get traction with their feet very well. So we will take the beds away, the towels away, and just have beds on one side. And then they're starting to potty on these pads here, right here and right here. And they do that on their own. They kind of figure out where they want to go. And we'll start to put down pee pads like we have there for mom and teach them to go on pee pads or newspaper like this one. See, he's walking over here to go pee. Thank you. That was perfect timing. <laughs> Good job. So they do that on their own and that way they train to certain areas and then of course once they get bigger and we take them outside, we will teach them to go outside. Okay, this is our puppy setup. Here we go. Thanks for watching.